Burrow Preserver 2000 here, back again doing another video here in Gainesville, Georgia now. This is, I, re I know Gainesville well because when I was really little I used to come up here for church, but this is something I remember from years ago. This is Gaines This is a little railroad display they have here in Gainesville on what's left of the old Gainesville Midland Main Line. This is the Seaboard Airline caboose here. But there's no real way to, uh, there's no other identifying markers other than that. But here is the prize of the collection, Gainesville Midland Decapod 209. I've already photographed, I've already filmed this engine before, but, well, I didn't, wasn't able to get good photos. Now I can, so, being said, I'm going to start with the caboose. Alright, so... One, two, three. Here we are. Now for 209's turn. But real quick, I'm going to walk through and show you guys. Now, unlike 208, which had the curved, the, the tender that had the curves up the side and the doghouse on the back, this one does not have that. This used to be a railroad museum at one point. It's an old Southern Railway baggage car. But this here is the, I guess you could say, city's pride and joy, which is 209. Pretty much well kept. Yeah, as long as I can remember. They sort of laxed off, but they've been trying to keep it up ever since for the past few years. So, one, two, three. Yeah, and I'm sorry about my shadow there. I can't help that. All right. You can see they've got it kept up pretty much in the same condition that I would that I ended up seeing 208 or not 208, excuse me. Listen to me talk. They've got the engine kept up in the same quality of preserve display as the two steam locomotives in North Platte, engines 480 and 3977. They've kept it that immaculate. But as you can see, don't know who, but somebody took the builder's plate off. I don't know if they, the ones keeping tabs on the engine, removed it to prevent it from being stolen or what, but that there, ooh, that makes me mad. But there's not much anything else, anyone else can do. So yeah, I'm gonna get a good picture of it right here. I heard rumors, a few whispers if you will, that there are talks about trying to restore this. I don't know, I, if, I get if it's cosmetic, but I don't know about operational. But you never know. But if it's good a shape as they're keeping this thing in, who knows? Maybe we might see this sucker run again one day. Might be quite a few years from now, but it could happen. It could happen. It would just depend on how they could get it out of its display area or if they could get something built over it to protect it from the elements while they get the funding needed to rebuild the engine. I mean, they've kept it immaculate, so it could be done. There's not a doubt in my mind that it couldn't be done. That it, There's no way they couldn't do it, but I know for a fact they could. But again, it's just a matter of funding, money, and just simply time. And if it could even be done, you don't see a lot of decapods in steam much anymore. In fact, I think that one of the few that are, that is still in steam, is uh, Strasburg 90. But again, just, I said it the last, first time I filmed here, just beautiful, beautiful locomotive. And I'm just 
excellent condition. I think the only thing that would need work is the windows. <laughs> Those are the only things that need to be that need to be cleaned. <laughs> You can see if I zoom in the uh, you can see the fireman side of the engine there. Engineer's side would be opposite of that. But uh, yeah. And just over here across the street is Gainesville Midlands home base and depot. This was the former Gainesville Midland Railroad Depot slash headquarters. The trackage here at that you see here is all that's left of the original main line which means they must have hauled 209 and some varying equip equipment down what was left of the main line and just parked it here while they tore up the re what was around it but that's just me but you can see the depot across the street there it's an art gallery but I don't think there's a way to access it I don't think it's open but other than that I believe that's it so, I will uh, see y'all later.